Hey everybody, how to download Pivot without worrying about getting a virus. There's a couple steps. First step is to go to pivotanimator.net um, and that's gonna bring you here. This is the official website for Pivot um, created by Peter Bone. Uh, you're gonna go to the download page and you're gonna select the uh, newest stable version. Um, there's older versions that you could also run if for some reason this isn't working. So I'm gonna say download Pivot Animator 4 and it's going to give me that option. I'm going to save it into my downloads. It doesn't matter where you save it. Um, downloads just helps you keep it organized and clean it up later. So I'm going to click Save. I've already downloaded it once before, so there's a one there. Yours won't have the one if you haven't downloaded it. When it's done down here in the corner, you're going to see it stops. I'm just going to click right on that. And this, I'm using Google Chrome as my browser, so you'll have to know where your download appears and if it helps use Google Chrome. Okay, welcome to Pivot Animator Setup. This is very important that you do not just click Next 50 times because you will have a problem. It will install programs you don't want. So I'm gonna say Next. I'm gonna agree to the basic liability for this program and say Accept License Agreement. Now it's asking if I, now for everyone it may be a little different, but it's basically gonna, there might be different programs that it's asking you to install. You're gonna decline. You do not want to install this program and then it's installing the uh, pivot. And then I'm gonna say finish. And then it's probably gonna ask again, see look at this asking, hey, a free diagnostic tool that checks for antivirus, which sounds great. Who knows, it might be amazing, but I am going to decline. You are not required to accept this and don't accept it unless that's something you really want. And if you're a student, ask your parents, do not install this um, because you will have things happen that you're not expecting. I decline and then it says launch the application on exit, which I'm going to do because I'd like to. You can uncheck it if you want. I'm going to leave it on so that it launches. And there's Pivot Animator. It's a simple, simple little program with a stick figure. And I have a lot of videos on how to animate. I'll just show you right now. I'll have him wave with his broken arm and hit play. There you go. We've downloaded it, installed it, didn't do anything funky to our computer. There's no viruses. You don't have to worry about that as long as you're careful. I've actually communicated with the maker of the program. His name's Peter Bone. I've emailed, I've reached out to him. And it, one of the ways they pay for this free program is they have advertisers. So those advertisers insert their software. So it will show up on some programs as a, a virus or a malware. Um, again, I'd call it irritation wear. It's like stuff that installs that it isn't necessarily bad for a computer, but will do something you're not expecting because you're expecting to install Pivot and you got this other program. So um, there you go. Have a great day. Hope this helps. And if you have any questions, please feel free to post them in the comments. Um, I'm also going to do another video at some point. There is a web-based, a way to do Pivot in a browser only. So if that's you, keep your eyes peeled for that video. Have a great day. Bye.